Hello everyone. Recently I have been asked about the question how I can program my Volkswagen EAP or one of its triplets to remember the last driving mode that I have set to the car. And I was thinking about how we can do that. Uh, that's why I wanted to make this video to talk about the driving profiles and what actually we can do to uh, drive the profile that we always uh, want to drive the car and not to have to manually select it from the, the uh, bottom. So as you may know, the uh, Volkswagen Yap, Škoda City Go EV or Seat Mi Electric have uh, three driving profiles. The one that usually is selected whenever you start the car is the normal driving profile where you have the full uh, power of the car and the speed limit is around 135 kilometers per hour. Uh, this is the profile that uh, I personally uh, usually drive my car. Uh, but uh, let's talk about the other two profiles. The next one is the Eco profile of the car, which uh, limits the amount of power you can... Uh, the, it limits the engine power of the car. So you accelerate a little bit slowly. And also it limits the uh, climatronic of the car, the power of the clim climatronic. Uh, and also uh, what else? It uh, limits the, the maximum driver speed. Uh, I think it was about 120 kilometers per hour. And the most conservative uh, driving profile is the Eco Plus uh, driving profile, where actually your car accelerates much, much slower. The uh, speed limit is 8 km per hour, uh, even though there is a way to work around this uh, speed limit. Uh, and also you don't have the climatization of the car. You can use the fan uh, that you can bring some uh, fresh air to the car, but you cannot heat or cool the car during the uh, Eco Plus uh, driving motor. So, uh, what can we do to uh, make the profile of the car selected by default? Actually, what you need to do is to program the air conditioning. Uh, I have made a video about that. I will put the link to the video description. Uh, when you, when you uh, program the car to remember the last set uh, temperature, then... Uh, what you need to do actually is to drive the way that the profile is tuned on. For example, if you want to drive always in Eco Plus mode, then you uh, turn off the air conditioning. It will be automatically remembered if you program the car. And whenever you start your car next time, the air conditioning will turn off. And it's up to you to drive slower and not accelerate uh, faster and exceed the 80 km per hour limit. This way, you will definitely achieve the Eco Plus uh, driving profile. To drive in Eco uh, mode, what you need to do is to uh, limit the air conditioning, the limit, limit the temperature of the air conditioning. It will be, uh, it will consume less power if you make the air conditioning to be around the ambient temperature of the surrounding around you. This way, uh, and also you can reduce the, you can uh, reduce the fan uh, speed, and this way actually you will uh, reduce the power the air conditioning drain from the high voltage battery. And the other thing is about you: not accelerate too fast, and also don't exceed 120 kilometers per hour. That's, I think, the way that you can actually be the programmable thing of the car that uh, can drive on the profile that you want to drive. You don't need to la actually limit the car, but you need to limit, I think, yourself to uh, drive as economic as uh, possible. I think that's it for this video. I think I, you got the point. It's up to us to drive uh, the profile that uh, we want to drive and be as uh, economic with the car as we want to. I hope you like this video. If you like it, give me a thumbs up. 
Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you soon.